Breaking news, ladies and gentlemen. Bloodshed on the southern side of London as three women and a man was knifed to death. The suspect is currently in custody, ladies and gentlemen. Greetings, greetings, and salutations to all nation. Ladies and gentlemen, you know I'm Rastafari, so to update Roots TV. Yes, and and if this is your first time tuning in, I'm asking you hit that red subscribe button. And we're going to have a great relationship, ladies and gentlemen. A Jamaican family is now weeping in the southern part of London. As three women and a man were found stabbed to death London Monday morning. A grandmother, Dolette Hill, originally from Linson in St. Thomas, Jamaica, has been named as one of the four people killed in Bermondsey on Monday. The mirror understand that the Hill, who that Hill, who was a 60-year-old victim, three generation of the same family, the Metropolitan Police said that the man in his late 20, known to the victim, has been arrested as one of the suspects committing the murder. And this is a dreadful discovery by the police. The police were called roughly 1.40 a.m. to report of disturbance at the home, South Bermondsey, with one witness claiming, <clears throat> excuse me, a group of armed officers ran into the home. Inside the police found people believed to have been stabbed to death. The Met said, Another witness claimed that they saw police laying down street receiving the bodies, receiving CPR. Three female victims were in their 30s, 40s, and 60s, and a man who was in his 60s. People claiming to be family members of those killed arrived at the scene shortly before noon. Despite the effort, emergency service, all four persons were pronounced dead at the scene, Scotland Yard said. In a statement speaking for the scene, and at this afternoon, the Metropolitan Police Commander Collins Wingroup said, in an early hour of the morning following the call by a neighbor officer's forced entry into a home inside the house, they made a dreadful discovery of four people who have been stabbed. All four were sadly and pronounced dead on the scene. A man in his late 20s was arrested at the address on suspicion of murder and in current is currently in custody at this early stage we are not looking for any other person we believe all those involved may have been known to each other i want to offer my heartfelt condolences to the family and friends of all those concerned this is deeply shocking incident and we will do everything we can to provide support to everyone affected at this difficult time, a large police present remained at the scene today where the barriers has been erected to block the road and several forensic tents are in place. An alleged witness has told the police when they see the them jumped out the cars with rifles after seeing the eight police cars as well as three ambulances arrived at the scene there were seven or eight police cars at the ambulance and the ambulance and neighbors told the London newspaper police jumped out with their rifles. We heard them go into there. All of a sudden they were quiet and we saw the full forensic people go in. Four body bags were loaded into a private ambulance. they following the discovery of the bodies. They were brought to the silver van from behind a metal fence blocking off the crime scene where forensic officers are continuing their investigation. The Met have said that officers are in the process of contacting the next of kin. The postmortem examination will be arranged soon. One man told the Mirror what his son, 15, saw in the early hours of the morning. He couldn't see he could see four police get out of a four by four fully armed with a machine gun and he explained to his dad he thought they had shot someone and they were given treatment to them by an ambulance. But obviously, this morning we heard there had been a stabbing. 
he was woken up by the police arriving to look out the window and in the his tired state he saw four people were lying in the street outside getting cpi i don't know exactly if he knew what happened a neighbor who didn't want to be named said it was i was watching telling you know what was going on really half the morning i heard a woman scream for about five minutes i was it was awful but when i heard the police and the helicopter and the ambulance i knew it was really serious i saw about eight or nine police cars all were armed come out and surround the area a man has been arrested on suspicion of murder and taken into southern Long london police station where he remained in custody a spokesperson for the london ambulance service said four person died at the scene and that one man was taken into the hospital as a priority they would not confirm whether the person hospitalized was the same one as the man arrested but did say only five persons were found in the house this story first appeared in the mirror.com at uk online and also it was edited in the mirror ladies and gentlemen this is a tragic situation because this appears to be a jamaican family you know that's involved in such a, a hideous horrendous situation and appears that you know four are dead three are women it appears it's the grandmother and her two daughters and her husband and it appears that the gentleman or the man that been taken into custody in his late 20s knew all these people ladies and gentlemen leave your comment if you know anything about this case i'm rastafari soldier sending my condolences to all the families and everyone that has been affected in this whole situation it's the sad situation again see it there the americans have over go we kill with family we kill with friend more life more joy more happiness ladies and gentlemen hit that red subscribe button if you have not subscribed as yet i'm rastafari soldier more life greetings more greetings life, more life. yes season greetings